you have dealt well with your servant. O Lord, according to your word, teach me good judgment and knowledge. For I have believed in your commandments. But before I was afflicted, I went astray. Lord, I have not forgotten the exhortation that addresses me as a son. You have said, My son, do not regard lightly the discipline of the Lord, nor be weary when reproved by him. For the Lord disciplines the one he loves and chastises every son whom he receives. And you have said that it is for discipline that I have to endure because you are treating me as a son. And what son is there whom a father does not discipline? Before I was afflicted, I went astray, but now I keep your word. You afflicted my soul, for that was what my soul needed. You are good and do good. Teach me your statutes. The insolent smear me with lies. But with my whole heart, I keep your precepts. Their heart is unfeeling like fat. But I delight in your law. It is good for me that I was afflicted. So that I might learn your statutes. Father, I have not forgotten the exhortation that addresses me as a son. My son, do not regard lightly the discipline of the Lord, nor be weary when reproved by him. For the Lord disciplines the one he loves and chastises every son whom he receives. Father, you have chastised me. You have disciplined me. Sometimes I feel that my soul has lined in the dust. It is good for me that I was afflicted, that I might learn your statutes. For the law of your mouth is better to me than thousands of pieces of gold and silver. You have dealt so well with your servant. Your ways are not my ways. Your ways are higher than my ways. And I understand that you had to afflict me or I would go astray. But now I keep your word. You are good and you do good. Lord, teach me your statutes. It is good for me that I was afflicted so that I might learn your statutes. The law of your mouth, O oh Lord, is better to me than thousands of pieces of gold and silver.